So Bob, we're down here in London doing promo stuff for the Max A Nutrition Knockout. How are you feeling? Yeah. Well, I'm feeling goodly. Um, everything's going well um, so far. And getting all this work done, getting a few shots and good promos and stuff. It's all part and parcel of the promoting the show. Obviously, you've won the English title. You've defended it against one of the guys in the competition, Travis. That's right. What would it mean to you to pick up that British belt? Well, the British title is the thing that's driving me right now. Um, it's the, that's the thing that me, it's going to mean the most, most important to me at this moment in time. Um, I've waited a long time, as you know, for, for this fight to take, to take place. I had to wait a little bit last year, sat on the shelf. Um, a couple of guys already, already pulled out of that fight last year. Um, so it was meant to take place then, but I'm just staying focused now, and that's my main aim to, to win that belt. Obviously, you've got Dean Francis. Uh, what, what have you seen of him? What, what do you make to him as a fighter? Yeah, Dean Francis obviously got good credentials. Obviously, you know, been a good fighter. Um, he's a good fighter. Um, you know, it speaks, it speaks for itself. Um, but I just, I just believe it's my time now. Um, I've waited long enough. It's my time, and um, I, I'm just going to get my hand raised and get, get the job done. That's, 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 that's uh, so all I am. This is a completely new tournament, a new platform on Terrestrial TV Channel 5. What does it mean to you to be a part of that? Oh, well, it's brilliant, obviously. It's brilliant exposure for myself and obviously just to get my career back on track and obviously hopefully start flourishing. And, um, it's, um, it's, a, it's a brilliant platform to be on, but I'm just taking one fight at a time, focusing on getting the British title and then I'll, then I'll take it from there. I've been asking a couple of these guys who they think the main rival is. Uh, a couple of them have said yourself. Who who are you looking yeah. at as your main rival? Yeah. Well, to be honest, really, I'm not. I'm, I'm looking at them all as a, on the same sort of plateau. I'm not. I won't say there's one particular rival. Um, they're all obviously good fights to be here. Um, and if I meet any of them, so be it. But I'm just focusing on the first things first. Take care of business. And stuff, I think. A couple of the guys, you've got Lee Duncan in here, Danny Mike, you've obviously trained with them two quite a lot. Yeah. What, what would it be like to get in the ring against those guys? Yeah, well, obviously, they're about, about, about the same um, stable. Um, did a bit of sparring with both of them, really. But if it, you know, if it happens, so be it. That's just, that's just, you know, that's the way this is set. This is where this is fell into this particular fight. It's fell into this tournament as well. So that's what I'm obligated to do. So if I have to box one of them. Then Part and parcel of the game. Yeah, yeah, that's it. It is a knockout tournament. You're fighting on the 15th in Reading. Yeah. How much are you looking forward to getting out there and getting underway? I'm very much looking forward to it, Nali. This is all, all bringing the, um, the atmosphere and stuff around, building up around it now, so I can't wait to get in there. Training preparation has gone well. Um, just stay focused and the uh, main thing is get, 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 in the, get in the W on the 15th. The fight was supposed to take place last year, as I said, but I just had to stay focused and I've got back on it this, since the beginning of the year, continuation from last year. That's all, that's all my, my mind's on, I'm training every day. What can the fans expect from you throughout this time? Well, I can expect you know, to showcase good boxing skills, slick um, movement and accuracy and power, and um, everything should come together as, as it has done before, as it would, and that's what I'm, that's what I'm going to do. They gave Tony Bellew a really firm test. Uh, yeah. That was not an easy fight for him. No. He got the decision, but yeah. obviously it was a very difficult fight for him. Yeah. Do you think it's that level where you should be fighting? Is this the perfect way to get yeah. there? Yeah, without a doubt, unquestionably. That's that's the level where I am and where I belong and where I've been at. It's been frustrating over the past few years not having not been as busy as, as I'd like to have been. And I can say I, I've been at this fight should only took place. I've been kept waiting. But um, yeah, definitely have some spam with Tony as well. Good, good match. So taking it as it comes, you know, I'm staying, keeping my feet on the ground and not, and not, um, obviously staying focused now. That's the main, the main thing. Also, this next fight throughout the whole year because 
that's the that's what I just have to do. And is there anything you'd like to say to your fans? Um, yeah, well, make sure you're tuning in on the 15th of March if you're not attending, which is down ready for so so for some of them, they probably won't be able to get there. But you can follow me on Twitter at Orange Set. Just make sure I keep it locked on the 15th to see a new a new British champion. That's it. Thanks.